I love all these palm trees here. Morning. Hi, Muffin. Oh, downward dog. <laughs> Hi. I was so excited to vlog in Abu Dhabi with Bart, but my camera died. My vlogging camera battery charger is in my flight attendant tote bag. I always have it in there because I'm always vlogging when I'm on my flight attendant trips. But you guys, Bart answered a few of your questions from Instagram and Bart's so cute. He's not used to being on camera. So it was just so funny to be like, to have the camera face him and ask him questions. He's like, yes. Hey Siri, set a timer for 15 minutes. Okay, 15 minutes and counting. Thank you, Siri. My pillow's propped up here. Face masks after a 14 hour flight are like life. I need to put all that nourishment back into my face. Time to unpack my luggage. And this portion of the vlog, guys, is sponsored by Away. Okay, I have to unpack. But one of my favorite things that I use constantly with the Away luggage is right here under all this other nonsense. Uh, no, didn't use packing cubes this time. Hot mess. I was packing in a hurry. But this, you guys, this is the laundry bag that comes with the Away luggage. I use this so much. This is one of my favorite features that the Away bags have. So right here, this is where the laundry bag, it literally folds up once there's like nothing in it and goes into its little home here. And it even has a little snap closure to hold it in there. Of course, all time best feature is the removable battery pack. This can charge your phone and it's got two, two USB connections here so you can charge two things at one time. And then you just press this button here and it lets you know how much charge is left on this. It comes in and out here so if you need to take it out to comply with airline or airplane regulations, you can. I have literally had this piece of luggage here for over a year, I've used it so many times. The Away luggage really is designed to last a lifetime. It's the only luggage that I travel with when I am personal traveling. When I'm a flight attendant, I have to use my approved airline, airline approved flight attendant issued luggage. <laughs> That's kind of a mouthful. So if anything were to break or something go wrong with your Away luggage, they will fix it for you. They stand behind their product. They will fix it. They will replace it. They will make it right. They will make you happy. So Away always gives me a promo code for you guys. So for $20 off a suitcase, go to awaytravel.com slash fly2019 and enter promo code fly2019 at checkout for $20 off a suitcase. So I've never really ordered a bag, a handbag online. Normally I go into the boutique and see the bag, buy it, you know, inspect the bag. But this is the first time that I ordered a bag online through my sales associate at the Chanel boutique. And I'm like scared to open it, but I'm going to unbox this item plus this other little item that I picked up. I'm gonna unbox that on my Stella Conley channel, so my second channel. Uh, I think most of you guys know about it, and you will really only go, only go over only go over to my Stella Conley channel if you guys are obsessed with handbags and like really super girly stuff. It's not. It has nothing to do with flight attendant stuff. Not really a lot to do with travel unless I'm like doing luxury travel handbags. So it's super, super guilty pleasure. So that will be unboxed over there and I'm so, I'm so excited about that bag because it's literally, I've been wanting this style bag for so long and I finally found the color that I wanted. I can't wait to unbox it. I'm like, I gotta get ready super fast so that I can film the video and post it over there so I can start wearing it. Look at this lens on my camera, you guys. I'm so professional and legit. This thing is so heavy. This is what I use to film my sit down videos on. And this lens is amazing. This is just the regular 
I think, T6i camera, but this lens is a Sigma lens and it makes a huge difference on this. And then just, of course, a Rode mic. It's real life here. This is my filming setup. This is my cameraman sleeping on the job. I'm gonna unbox these two things and see, you can see the viewfinder there. And this is where I will sit and I'll be like, hey guys, so I just got these two new things. Let's unbox them. <laughs> In the reflection there, it looks like Lord of the Rings, like come bring the ring to me. <laughs> so just got done filming my Chanel unboxings and the bag that I got, I got the bag delivered to me. I didn't see the bag at the store because um, they didn't have any left. So I had the bag actually delivered to my apartment. So I'd never seen it. So I unboxed it on camera. <laughs> and yeah, let's just say we're going back to Chanel now and we're gonna see what can be done. This is sunny in New York today. Empire State Building, guys. I need an errand. And I am, I'm heading over to Hudson Yards. So, I don't know if you guys have seen the vessel at Hudson Yards. It's this new thing called the vessel. It's really cool. It's where like all the Instagrammers are taking all their pictures. So I'll show you guys. I'll show you guys that. I posted it on my Instagram feed, I think. It was like the big thing a few months ago. <laughs> so I'll show you guys. <clears throat> That's a New York tip right there, guys. This vessel thing. It's where you want to get the best Instagram pictures. Okay, and this is Hudson Yards. Coming in here, going to Neiman Marcus. So no. Actually, an exchange here. I can't believe that unboxing was such a fail. Like, 100% failed unboxing. So I heard this is a really good restaurant here in Hudson Yards. I haven't tried it yet. One of my favorite Louis Vuitton stores here. I work with Tia and Monique there. Oh, look. And see the vessel down there. Look how tiny everybody looks. I love Neiman Marcus. It's always so quiet and clean. It's definitely quiet in here because it's so expensive and not a lot of people come shopping here. <laughs> Let's be honest. This is my favorite section of the grocery store. I love this kimchi. I already got one here. And I like these ramen noodles. This is like my favorite meal. I make the noodles and then I eat it with the kimchi. Shake, shake, shake. Oh, good boy. Good boy, stink muffin. Good boy. Okay, let's get these shoes off. So easy, I don't even have to untie these. Hello. This is this is like the lazy person I top. I'm literally obsessed. That's the best. Hi! Who is that? Is that your hedgehog? Is that Hedge? Oh, Ragamuffin needs a needs a haircut. Oh! I'm gonna get him. I'm gonna get him. Look at his little tail. 
Okay, you win. Okay, also I got a few of these little chocolates that I love from this chocolate store at Hudson Yards. And then from H&M, I got this sweater thing. Let me put it over here. <laughs> it's, hard. it's hard to show you with like one hand, but it's a turtleneck sweater from H&M. I love that color. And then H&M has the best beanies. I got this beanie here and I got this scrunchie and, and this beanie also. These are very similar in color, but this one doesn't have the little fuzzy ball thing. And this is more like knitted and this one's just Kind of regular. Oh, thank you. Thank you. How nice! <laughs> Our building is giving us candy. Wow, great! Look how nice this is. Oh my gosh! They give you a little bag and you can put whatever candy you want. Franny, you want some candy? <laughs> Dog park. It's a little out of control right now. Look, guys. Trash day in New York City. So Franny has had a little bit of an upset stomach. So he is not able to go into the dog park right now. He's on quarantine. Oh, poor Franny. It's so sad walking by the dog park because he wants to go in, he sees all the other dogs and he wants to go in, but he's just had a little bit of an upset stomach and and I, I don't really want to risk it. I don't want him to go in there and, you know, I want him to be 100% health before he can go into the dog park because there's a lot of germs in there. Franny, we're gonna do your point of view, a day in the life of Franny. Come here, Fran Bear. Come here, come here. Oh, good boy. I'm sorry you couldn't go in the dog park, but you have a little tummy ache. All right, Franny, come on. Day in the life of you, go. Come on. We need a Franny cam. Wait. Okay. <laughs> Good job. Good job. Okay, mom's gonna make you your special meal. So because Franny has a little bit of an upset stomach, the vet recommended plain chicken and rice and a little pumpkin puree. So I'm gonna put it in his little bowl here. So it looks a little funky, but I'm also gonna put a little bit of water in it because he's a little, he's not drinking his water as much. This is like a very fall meal for you, Fran Bear. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. And I like these noodles so much because like real noodles. They're not like the dried hard noodles. This is like almost like pasta. And then you get this really good sauce. There's a three pack in here, but I don't need all those. So this can just go in there. Wow, what's going on over here? Why is that so high? Okay, this must be a new show on Netflix because I've never seen it, but I just saw the preview and I think I'm gonna watch it. Okay, so here are the ramen noodles. Woo, they're hot. But like the sauce that comes with these noodles is literally like the sauce you would get at a ramen noodle restaurant. So I'm gonna have it with kimchi here. And I put this uh, spicy like pepper seasoning, red pepper, nice tasty. <laughs> I've never read that. So I love this in my noodles. And you guys, these chopsticks are literally going on my next Amazon favorites haul. They're like stainless steel chopsticks and they are literally amazing. I'm on Amazon looking for like longer lasting chopsticks and I found these stainless steel ones and I died. These are amazing. 
Okay, ah, I'm sure all of you know what kimchi is, but like a fermented cabbage, and it's um, I don't know, it's like spicy. It's it's so good. So I literally like will take a bite of kimchi and then some noodles and call it a day. Okay, let's try these noodles. I feel like they're oh my gosh, yeah. Look at that. They're a little hot, but let's try them. <laughs> they always like steam up my glasses. Okay. Mmm. Oh my gosh. The seasoning is so good. And I just eat the kimchi out of here because nobody's here to eat this kimchi with me. So I'll just like eat it myself. I'll just eat directly. I'll drink out of the almond milk carton all day long. Nobody here to share it with except Franny. He doesn't really like almond milk though. Woo! Ooh. These are hot, hot, hot. Ooh. I need my red pepper nice and tasty flakes on here. Ooh, this looks good. These aren't very spicy. I thought at first these were gonna be super spicy. They even smell spicy, but they're not. They don't really, they're not much of a kick there. So I'll put that in there. What I'm, I even like to do is I like to put the kimchi into, oh gosh, into the soup. Woo! That way all the flavors, everything gets mixed in there. Kind of like we're having like a little dinner together, guys. I haven't done personal vlogs at home in so long. This is like a McBang, McBong. I don't know how to say it, McBong, McBang. Mm. So many of you guys have been asking me about Vlogmas. But I kind of have some bad news. I am gonna be out of the country the first few days of December. I think the first week of December. So if I do Vlogmas, hey Franny, it's gonna start a little later. So I don't know guys, what is Franny doing back there? He's so cute. This is so good with putting the kimchi in the noodles because they, they it, it like literally like warms them up. And there's like no cute way to eat noodles, you guys. They like fall out of your mouth and then they go back into the bowl. I don't know, is anybody cute when they eat noodles? Who wants me to start a McBong channel? <laughs> With Franny in the background. Franny could be like my McBong partner, McBang partner. Mac, Mac, bon, Mac bong. That is the weirdest word. Where did that word come from? Who invented McBongs? Some of those channels have literally like a million followers. I'm like, with like two million, four million. There's that guy, Zach Choi. He's got like four million followers. I'm like, okay now. Sign me up. I'm starting one. <laughs> okay guys, I'm gonna finish my noodles and Franny's gonna take a nap and we're gonna watch Daybreak on Netflix right now. I also wanna watch the, the, the movie Eli and I also just finished <laughs> Fran, <laughs> I also just finished, what was oh, that one? Oh gosh, this is loud. Um, wait, living with yourself, yeah, wait, 
Living With Yourself with Paul Rudd. You guys, he's so cute. I'm so getting clueless vibes. Like, I loved it. I binged watched it. It was really good. Okay, bye guys. See you later. Say bye, Franny. Day in the life of Franny and Stella's new McBong channel. Mmm. <laughs> oh, that was kind of a cute noodle eat.